last people coming in. Come in, come in, join. Can you all hear me, by the way? A lot more volume. There we go. It'll be like, hello. Okay, I think it's time to get the show on the road, don't you? Yeah, let's do this. So, hi everybody. Welcome to Selenium Conf 2013. It is fantastic and amazing and brilliant and so many wonderful words uh, to see you all. Um, I'm Simon Stewart, I'm the current project lead and um, it's my pleasure today to just introduce you all to the conference and run through some notes and then we're gonna see some really, really great talks. Um, so yes, by the way, if you're on Twitter, the hashtag is hash seconf. That's like the word second, but with an F at the end. If you've been following that hashtag, it turns out a large part of the world can't spell the word second. <laughs> so um, thank you very much to our sponsors. Um, we've got uh, Selenium level sponsors like CompuWare um, and Facebook and um, the platinum level sponsors Bugbuster, Source Labs, Constant Contact, Mozilla. Um, thank you so much for sponsoring this and making this conference possible. Um, we like to try and keep the ticket prices as low as we can so that people who are in the town where we're holding the conference can attend without needing to go through a lot of hoops and jumps with their um, particular companies that they work for. And if it wasn't for the sponsors, we wouldn't be able to do that. So thank you very much to the sponsors. Essentials. Who wants Wi-Fi? If you do, um, then the, the, the network ID is Conference Renaissance, and the password is CCONF 2013, capital S, capital C. Um, you may have noticed that when you came in, we gave you a name tag. What you may not realize is that name tag is also the conference program. If you just pull out the um, the, the, the paper insert, you can unfold it and it will give you the program of what's going on. So you can see what's happening, um, where you can go and you can plan your day and stuff like that. It also contains the network ID and name. That information is wrong. The password is right. Um, the, ne the, the network name that you really care about is Conference Renaissance. And the hashtag, for if you're on Twitter um, or Google Plus or anywhere else that accepts hashtags, maybe your email does, I don't know, um, is cconf. Uh, input output, we will be serving lunch. It will be out there in the atrium. Um, if you've got any special dietary restrictions, if you're veg vegetarian, um, vegan, if you only eat bacon, I don't know. Uh, yeah, okay, one person here only eats bacon. Um, please go to the check-in table and talk to a member of staff who's gonna be there. Um, you can tell the members of staff uh, they've got a green tag on the bottom of their, their, their name tag. So you'll be able to spot them very easily, um, and they're all lovely. Um, in terms of output, toilets are located over there on the third floor atrium. We're suckers for an easy joke at this conference, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, I'm not really sorry. There's gonna be a party. It's gonna be tonight. Um, it is at 7.30 p.m. at Lucky's Lounge which is 355 Congress Street. We're at 606 now, so it's really not far. It's a short walk away. Um, there'll be drinks and plenty of appetizers, um, but we're not gonna be serving like full-on meals. So if you're a person who likes to sort of have a, have a decent feed before they go out drinking and celebrating, I recommend just having a quick snack before you go. Um, but there will be loads of appetizers. There will be drinks. It'll be really good to see everybody there. Um, and that's the map. You literally turn out of the hotel, walk down the road. You can't miss it. Having said that, I've now guaranteed that at least five of you will miss it. This year, we've organized the conference into two tracks. Um, there's an unconference in track B, and there's a sign-up form just outside where you can sort of put your talks. Um, those are going to be full-length talks, and you'll be able to talk about anything that takes your fancy, provided there's a slot. Um, I think that's always quite good fun. Um, there's also going to be a set of lightning talks this year. Um, and it's a really great chance to get your message across. Now, the lightning talks are only five minutes long, so don't expect to be able to cover like the, the entirety of War and Peace or, or Les Miserables or anything like that. Um, but you will be able to, I beg your pardon? 
It'll be strictly timed, says Jim Evans, who's sitting at the front here. Um, and at the end of the conference, uh, we are going to have a, an extended committer Q&A. The program says there's going to be a closing keynote. We've extended the Q&A session for the committers, um, so that will be a, a full hour long. And if you've got any questions that you'd just like to, to, to get in the queue um, and have ready, there's a Google moderator link, which is, um, I, ex oh, I always expect something to be right behind me, but it's not. It's over there. Um, you can read the URL. We will make sure that we put it up in the, in, in the atrium so you can figure that out. Um, but if you have got any questions for the, for the committers, just feel free to throw it out there. Um, by the way, I like to do this every year. I take it you all do use Selenium. Yeah. Do any of you use water? OK, a couple of, couple of water people. Um, the Selenium users, how many of you are using IDE? OK, so I mean, the first year we did this, um, there was no one in the audience. And now there's what, about a quarter of you, I think. Um, how many of you are using Selenium RC? OK, the Selenium web driver? Good on you. Well done. <laughs> uh, and Selenium Grid. OK. And how many of you are spending a majority of your time coding? And how many of you are yep, a majority of time coding? Most of you. And uh, doing manual testing or following scripts? A, a few less. Right. So um, my takeaway is you're all fairly technical, technically competent. Um, and you're going to have a really great time in some of the talks. Um, there are going to be talks that are focused on sort of the IDE users and things like that as well. So that's going to be really good fun. Um, before we go any further, I'd just like to thank the organizing committee as well. Um, they've done an absolutely stellar job this year. Um, they've done a really slick thing. Um, in particular, I'd like to call out Marcus Merrill, Leo Laskin, Bob Silverberg, Sean Lally, and Ashley Wilson. Um, they've been sort of the driving force that helped make sure this conference actually happens and takes off the ground. The other group of people that I'd like to thank are the Software Freedom Conservancy, the SFC. Um, I don't know, the, the, the Software Freedom Conservancy is like the biggest group you've never heard of. Um, they're the ones that sort of provide um, the infrastructure around the project that enable us to continue. So they help us do things like organizing venues, negotiate contracts, um, they provide legal cover, um, and they provide like a really good home for the Selenium project as a whole. They're also the home of, of a bunch of other projects, including things like um, Wine and Boost and um, a whole, whole bunch of other ones. If you've got the time, if you've got uh, the opportunity, go and have a look at, at the Software Freedom Conservancy website. They do absolutely amazing work. Um, and we very much appreciate all that they've done for us. And that brings me to the end of my exciting slides. Um, so this is going to be the room for track A. Um, there's going to be track B just over there. And if you want like a breakout room, if you want like a, a quiet space where you can sit, you can um, do your email, you can have a chat, you can prepare your slides at the last possible second, um, the breakout rooms are over there. If you were here for the workshops yesterday, they're basically where we were having the workshops. So feel free to sort of go in there if you need just a quiet space. Um, don't forget, conference program is in here. And I hope you guys have an absolutely amazing time over these next two days. Thank you very much for being here. And on that bombshell, find a talk and go to it. The first speaker would like to come up here. That would be good.